What is O? Oh, in this video, we are going to work through some problems involving the algebraic properties of logarithms. I've got a few statements here. As you can see, a log base 3 of x equals 5.3, a log base 3 of y equals 2.1, log base 4 of u equals 3.2, and log base 4 of v equals 1.3. I'm going to work through a few problems for you. For example, here, let's see, log base 4 of 2uv. log base 4 of 2 uv okay uh, from our properties of logarithms we know that when we're, when we're multiplying in here that we are adding exponents and remember the log gives us exponents so that is this is log base 4 of 2 plus log base 4 of u plus log base 4 of v okay uh, log base 4 of 2 uh, what's that going to be uh, 4 to the 1 half the square root of 4 equals 2 so that's going to be 1 half uh, plus log base 4 of u from upstairs that's going to be 3.2 plus uh, log base 4 of v is going to be 1.3. Alright. So what's that going to be? 0 0.5, 10, carry the 1, 3, 4, 5. Is that going to equal 5? Uh, let me make sure. Bro. 1.3, 0 0.5, and 3.2. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, carry the 1, 3, 4, 5. Okay. So I think that's going to be our final answer there is 5. work through some more of these. Oh, let's see, what's the next one here? Log base 4 of u divided by 8v. Log base 4 of u divided by 8v. Okay? Wow. So this is going to equal, uh, when we're dividing, we're subtracting the exponents, so that's going to be log base 4 of u minus log base 4 of 8v okay which equals log base 4 of u we know that that's going to be 3.2 minus and now we have we're multiplying inside here so that's going to be minus log base 4 of 8 plus log base 4 of V and so we're going to get 3.2 minus log base 4 raised to what power equals 8 uh, so 4 is going to be 2 squared equals uh, and 8 is what 2 cubed so I need the power 4 this is 4 raised to what power equals 2 cubed. So what's going to go up here? Uh, 3 halves. So you got I know, you got to think about that one. That is going to be log base 4 of 8 is 3 halves. That is 4 4 raised to the 3 halves is going to equal 8 because this is going to be 4 to the 1 half cubed uh, which is so that's going to be 2 2 cubed equals 8. Okay? Ah, so that's minus 3 halves and then minus log base 4 of V which is 1.3 alright and that's going to equal let me break the calculator out and these decimals in my head 3.2 uh, minus uh, two, 2 goes into 3 what uh, 1.5 1.5 minus 1.3 I should have just done that one in my head, right? Uh, 0 0.4. So 3.2 minus 3 halves, which is 1.5 minus 1.3, is 0 0.4. Okay? Well, that's that one. Let's see if we can find another one to do here. 
using these properties. Um, log base 3 of the square root of x. So let's look at that. Log base 3 of the square root of x. Okay? And so this is going to equal log base 3 of x to the 1 half. That's what the square root of x means, x to the 1 half. So properties of logarithms says I can bring that 1 half down. Get 1 half times log base 3 of x. And that's going to equal, I know the log base 3 of x is 5.3. So that's going to be 1 half times 5.3 times 5.3 2 .65. 2 .65. It's only equal 2.65 final answer okay Let's see how much time we got we're looking good 6 minutes and 30 seconds I've got time for at least one more, maybe maybe a couple. I gotta keep these things right at the ten minute mark or YouTube won't let me load them to load them up. So let's switch colors. Um, let's look at another one here. Let's look at that looks like a good one. Number twenty eight here is log base four. Uh, I've already done a bunch of using V's, haven't I? Well, let's do it anyway. Log base four of u cubed v to the fourth u cubed v to the fourth okay so we're multiplying u cubed times v to the fourth so that's going to equal log base four of u cubed plus log base four of v to the fourth and properties of logarithms Let's me bring those exponents down. So that's going to be 3 times log base 4 of u plus 4 times log base 4 of v. And so that's going to equal 3. What is log base 4 of u? 3.2. 3 times 3.2 plus 4 times log base 4 of v is 1.3. Right. So we're going to get 3 times 3.2 plus 4 times 1.3. 3 times 3.2 plus 4 times 1.3. 14.8. Okay. And let's see if we have time for one more. Let's do one quickly. Oops. Let me make some space here. Okay, let me see if I have I need a hard one. <laughs> uh, let's do log base 4 of 1 over the square root. Log base 3. Log base 3 of 1 over the square root of y. Okay? So that's going to equal log base 3 of uh, 1 over y to the 1 half, which equals log base 3 of y to the negative 1 half. Properties of logarithms equals a negative 1 half times log base 3 of y which is going to equal a negative one half log base three of y. Where's that at? 2.1. So we're going to get negative one half, so a negative point five times 2.1. And negative 1.05. All right, and I think that's going to do it for this video uh, using some properties of logarithms. Hope it helps you out. What is O?